Hi everyone, it's Miss Stacia, and I was perusing through one of Genevieve's magazines, and I found this, and I thought it was perfect for the time that we're living in right now. The prayer says, Dear God, please help me have patience. I know that when I have to wait for something, it is because you know what's best for me. Help me to have patience with my parents, my sisters, and my friends. Help us to remember that you will give us our dreams when our hearts are set on you. Amen. And what this is, is 10 things you can do while you're waiting. So it says, while you wait, sometimes waiting for something to happen. When you're waiting for something to happen, it's a good idea to find something else to do. So here's a few ideas to help the time go faster. Number one, dance. Break out your best dance moves. Number two, teach yourself something. It could be anything. Playing an instrument, sewing, a dress for a doll, decorating a cake, baking your favorite cookies, or sharpening your Photoshop skills. Or maybe your video making skills if your name is Stacia. Number three, create a board game. Use trinkets from around your house as the pieces. Number four, organize a play. Come up with a plot, write a script, pick costumes, set the stage, and present the show to your family's family and friends. Maybe even video it and put it up on our YouTube page. Number five, spend time with your family. We're getting to do lots of that lately, and I hope that you guys are finding fun and creative ways to spend time with your family. Number six, have a photo shoot. Oh, that's fun. Number seven, take a nature walk. Take pictures, collect items, and create a fun craft when you return. Hopefully most of you live in an area where you can take a little walk around your yard or um, even around your neighborhood if, if people aren't outside, and you could try that one out. Number eight, set up a treasure hunt. Hide fun things around your house. Write clues and send your... Well, this says friends out to find them, but you'd have to send your family members right now. But still, you could work. It could work. Number nine, write a letter or note to someone. That's a great way to keep busy while you're waiting and also encourage others that are stuck at home and may be lonely and not have family with them. Number 10, spend time with God read your Bible and talk to him, which is always an important thing for us to do. But especially now when things are um, more difficult and confusing, it's always a good idea. I want to go back to eight real quick. My daughter, Emma, I think had the idea or Genevieve or maybe both of them to um, set up a treasure hunt with your friends where you make a list together of things that you could find when you were taking a walk around your neighborhood or um, taking a short drive with your family um, and then see who could find the item. So anyway, I hope that this encourages you to wait with purpose and um, continue to check back as we add some new things. Have a great day.